Calvin Clark with us here on the John Mandola Show. Done more buck soccer. Senior year. Finally here. Recruiting things over. That's good for you, right? Yep. Talk yeah. a little bit about that whole process and, uh, you know, the school you decided on. Yeah. Um, to be honest, it was kind of pretty quiet going into the summer. I had a decent travel season and then um, I got into a couple camps and I went to Lafayette for a camp with a bunch of schools and I had a really good camp and I already had a non-official visit with Lafayette over the spring and then they... Um, they like what they saw and they decided to give me an offer and so I just accepted it because I love it there and I love the head coach and the assistant coach that I got to work with as while I was there. Far enough from home but it's still with a reasonable drive. Uh, yeah. Talk a little bit about what you what attracted you to there at Lafayette. Um, really it was just the coaches. The coaches were really good guys to me and I like their personalities. Um, I got to meet a bunch of coaches through visits and just recruiting calls and I thought that they were like just really good people and they understood the whole like process and it wasn't so much about soccer it's more about like becoming a better person to them and so I really like that that's why I like How about a major you got to find that when you get to a, a, yeah. a school and you know it has to kind of fit so uh, talk about what you're thinking about going into yeah I think I want to um, major in business and finance I'm not really sure yet but something along that path let's talk about the Dunmore Bucks here for 2024 uh, what talent is coming back and how do you feel you guys will be yeah um we lost our keeper and two defenders, but I mean, I think this team is going to be really good. We have a lot of a lot of potential. There's a bunch of guys that are on the team last year that didn't get too much playing time, but they should show well this year. I think they definitely could. And Connor's younger brother, Russell, is also a really good player coming up as a freshman. So everybody kind of has a good amount of experience. We only have two freshmen coming in, so the team's going to be a little bit older, but I still think we have a good chance of doing well. I know you're always priding yourself on staying in great shape, so talk about, you know, you feel like you're, you're going to be peaking here at the right time. Yeah, um, definitely. Kind of like not in the greatest of shape right now, which is kind of good. I don't like killing myself over the summer. I kind of take it easy and then ease into it as the season gets started. But um, we start mandatory practices on Monday, and we've been practicing three days a week throughout the summer. And I think everybody feels pretty confident in where we are right now. We're going to talk with a couple other seniors. Tell us about both of those guys and what they bring to the squad. Yeah, um, two really, really important players. We wouldn't be nearly as good, or I wouldn't be nearly as good without them. And Everything's a team effort here. It's not really individual, and we all really like each other. There's no hate between the team. It's a good community. Let's talk about the, you know, being in the halls of Dunmore, being a student athlete there, and your experience and what it's like. Yeah, um, Dunmore's great. I mean, you know all the teachers. You know everybody in your class. Everybody's really close together for people that do sports, basically. And if you don't like each other, you don't like each other. It's known, and so you kind of have to get forced to like each other. So it's just it's a good environment to be in if you're on a soccer team or your other teams because of the, some of the bigger schools probably don't have like the bond we all have together. And as far as uh, you know, other members of your family, I know your dad's a coach. you got a relationship with him, but uh, who else is helping you along the way there and the academic, the meals, all that stuff? Yeah, um, my mom. mom's a really good cook. I love her food. Um, throughout the soccer process, I got to work with Jenton. Um, up in Lakeland, I think it is, and he helped me um, throughout the last couple of years. And then, not so much this year, I haven't been with him as much this year, but I want to get back with him. And then, my grandparents are always really helpful with me. All right. Well, you got it uh, going. You wrote a ticket to what you want to do for the future, and I hope you have a successful senior season. Thank you.